Hello, everyone. This is Dr. Talib Bilal, faculty FMG. So today I'm here to welcome Dr. Reshma, who recently qualified FMG Jan 2024 examination in a first very attempt. So congratulations, Dr. Reshma, from whole FMG team. Thank you, sir. Hello, everyone. Uh, I'm Dr. Reshma Nina Ramachandran. I graduated from Bukovinian State Medical University, DSMA, Ukraine. I cleared my FMG in my first attempt with a score of 161. And I would like to thank God Almighty for his blessings and my parents, my teachers, and whole AFMG team for helping me to achieve this success. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Rishma. You really deserved it. You have worked hard. So, Dr. Rishma, can you tell us about you, when sir. did you actually start preparing for these exams? When did you start your study? Uh, so, I joined AFMG in my second year. Uh, it was a vacation batch, two months course. So, during my med school, I joined AFMG vacation batch. And when I went back to Ukraine, I used those notes for preparing my university examination as well as I uh, used standard textbooks at that time. Uh, then uh, after my graduation, I joined AFMG for the regular course. Good. Okay, Dr. Reshma, can you tell us about uh, what was your strategy? Like uh, a lot of students are confused, like uh, how many hours to spend on your notes, how many hours to spend on your MCQs. So can you tell us about how, how did you divide your time? in a particular day, like how much time you used to spend on your notes and how much time you used to spend on your MCQs? So actually I'm an early bird. I used to wake up around four or five in the morning. Okay. So from four to seven, I used to revise my notes. Uh, and after that, I will take one hour break. And by eight o'clock, to 10 o'clock again, I will revise my notes. And then after that, I will take from around 15 minutes break. Then I will start doing MCQs till 1 p.m. And after that, if I need any rest, I will take some time. Again, I will continue uh, doing MCQs till evening. Uh, then at around 8 p.m., actually I have joined uh, FMG with Dr. Palipas is our channel. So okay. uh, I have done those MCQs at 8 o'clock. <laughs> uh, then I will review the MCQs the same day. If I feel any difficulty solving questions, I used to contact you. Uh, then I will do MCQs until around 10, till I feel exhausted. That's great. That's great. So what role did AFMG play in your preparations? Uh, AFMG played a vital role in my preparation. Without AFMG, I couldn't get the success. Um, the teachers are the most important part of AFMG. I am grateful to all the teachers, uh, especially Dr. Sir, Dr. Umkar, sir, Dr. Talib Bilal, sir, uh, Dr. Master, of the faculties, uh, for QR session, test discussions, revision sessions, and all motivations given by the teachers. They right. were so helpful. So, we are glad, the whole FMG team is glad to help you guys. And uh, we are a part of your success. That's really nice. So how many GTs you gave in your whole preparation? Like in this last six months, how many GTs you have attended? Yes, sir. So I started giving GTs in my final year med school. Okay. But I was uh, not regular at that time. But when I joined a FMG regular course in July, uh, it was in August, um, so Dr. Talibullah sir, uh, for gynecology session. So on that day, you told the importance of giving GTs. Uh, from that day onwards, I give GTs. 
till the exam i took 10 days okay good so your score was improving day by day and i reviewed it nicely yes sir it was improving that's good so uh, you have an access to the nafmg app as well right so uh, revision sessions uh, qrs sessions by yes, kamkar pyq sessions and the rapid revision sessions what role they play in your success can you tell your viewers like what role did they play um yes sir uh, according to me it so for subject after revising the notes along with that i used to do topic and sequence okay like right this and after that test and discussion after doing all this i felt like i have done that subject uh, so this test and discussion by dr omkar sir it played a very important role in my success very good very good okay so can you tell us about which part of afmg played in very vital role and uh, about the sources do you okay. feel yeah the sources are enough you don't need to go anywhere else so what message you will give to the repeaters who are a part of an fmg again so what advice you will give to them uh i would like to tell them that uh, faculties are the important part of fmg yes. and the content given in fmg is sufficient <clears throat> for them to cross the border line um even the what content you have revise maximum tense rather than uh, going for different sources what all you are getting from fmg utilize it maximum very nice very nice so during this preparations and during this uh, whenever the exam was closer you and the dates were announced so everyone like anxiety stress and this is a normal thing right so how did you tackle those situations when you are having anxiety or if what if you have scored yes, late in your gts so how did you tackle that situation uh, sir uh, anxiety and stress they are part of our journey so uh, at optimum level it's okay i felt uh, and my mom was my support system um uh, and whenever i feel low she used to support me and my teacher also supported me uh, when i'm feeling low and you also were really help me a lot um and stress anxiety and gts uh, give an impact on our preparation uh, they will help us to know what are our weak points weak subject and time management exactly. anxiety management as well as uh, those important topics okay so what will be your final advice to the fmgs so what they have to focus on uh start your preparation early then you should trust afmg uh okay. give your 100 percentage in this 6 months duration and don't be anxious solve mcqs daily increase the number of mcqs daily That and is. give gts don't be afraid of giving gts they yeah. are a game changer don't waste time and listen to your teachers follow their strategies yes sir okay thank you dr reshma we whole fmg team are glad to be the part of your success and hearty congratulations to your family as well as you have cracked the exam in your first very attempt guys and thank you for sharing your success stories so it can help the viewers thank you dr reshma thank you Thank you sir thank you AFMG team thank you Dr